Well, g'day guys. I thought I'd just show you this little town. I'm in the middle of nowhere, travelling from uh, through Queensland to somewhere, working my way back to Victoria anyway. But I'm at Cal... Cal... Calvin. Cal Calvin. Home of the Great Horse Ride. So... But what I like about it is there's nothing here. It's this little, little town with this big oval. This big oval. And I just thought I'd stop and have a, I'd stop and stretch my legs because I don't know why, but I really like it. So I'm going to stretch my legs. I'll go over here, check out the old footy shed. Go to the bathroom, have something to eat, and then keep driving. So, yeah, I like it. And the weather is beautiful. It's uh, I don't know what time it is. 11 o'clock, but it's not too hot. It's not too cool. This is just a really, really nice paddock. Beautiful big trees over there. I might go check them out. It's just really nice. All right, we'll go check out the footy sheds. <coughs> Cool. I sit in one of those chairs. How unreal is this? I don't really like heights actually, this is a little bit too high, but this is so good. I'd like to watch something going on down there from here. <laughs> Beautiful, eh? Well, my car's over there. I'll go back and uh, <clears throat> keep driving, I guess. How yeah, excellent. Okay. Hey guys, so I'm just sitting in my van. I'm still in the same place I was this afternoon when I showed you that little town. I forget what it's called. But I can't work out whether to go bloody north back to up into Queensland or south into New South Wales and back to Victoria. I'm sitting here eating my dinner. Cold steak, cold rice, some tomato, some cheese, some whatever you call that some um, other stuff in there <coughs> avocado <coughs> well, I'm still getting my food but I'm getting, <coughs> getting over it slowly yeah I don't know which way to go because it's bloody 2,000 kilometres back to Victoria and it's cold and I've got accommodation there but I've got no furniture so I'm sitting in a cold house with no furniture no furniture at all only what's in this van but, but I can get out of this van and I'm so keen to get out of this van I go back to Queensland, uh, further up to Queensland, back to Early Beach where I was. And try again to get a job and try again to get a room. But in the meantime, before I get a job and a room, and I haven't had any success yet, I'm stuck in this hot van. So, oh, I'm stuffed if I know. So I've sat here all day and just gone nowhere because so far to drive south and if I change my mind and go back to where I came from I've just driven an extra hour or two south so I've moved nowhere, it's such a waste of time it's 
So I'm sitting here eating my cold dinner. I'm not sure which way to go. Both going back to where I came from or south has its pros and cons. The only reason I was going back to Victoria really was because I thought to myself, I go back to Victoria, there's potential to get work down there through a friend, but my thinking was, my main thinking, if I go to Victoria, I'm out of this van in five days, because it's a five day drive. I don't want to go to Victoria, I'm not really interested in doing that, I want to stay up here and try and finish what I started. If I go to Victoria, I'm out of the van in five days. If I stay up here, I'm stuck in the van for who knows how long. So my thinking is just how do I get out of this van the quickest possible time. It's disgusting, cramped and hot. Yeah. Oh, my battery's flat in the light. Oh, I keep eating my dinner anyway. Well folks, I'm in the middle of, I have no idea where, at the Mal Mac McLogan store. Maybe I'm at McLogan, I don't know. Middle of nowhere. My GPS has taken me, I swear, the longest route possible. Bloody GPS, it's um... I don't know. It's a pretty old one, but I've always had trouble with it. It's a Tom Tom, and it bloody takes you to the back roads instead of the highways, and shows you different routes than your mobile phone. So it's all up there. Crap. <coughs> anyway, I'll keep driving. I stopped and had a stretch, and just thought, oh, I'd check this joint out in the middle of nowhere. <coughs> So we'll keep driving. Well, g'day guys. I'm just uh, taking a break. I'm at a truck stop, maybe 200 k's north of Dubbo in New South Wales. So I'm cooking myself a hot drink, some bone broth. And it's uh, no one else here. Just a truck stop. The world's largest virtual solar system drive, apparently. So. Don't forget to give the video a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, that way you'll get notified to all my new videos when I upload them. And if you want to contact me, you can do so through my website, the link's in the description below. See you next time.